Jezebel can sense when you don't like her, and that's when she like you. A lot of them can do that. They can sense your interest level. They can sense that. And they, they want to know what it's going to take to get you to act like the other guys. I bet if I get on my knees, you're going to like me like the other guys do. I bet if I act like I like you, you're going to you're gonna lower your guard down because you're going to think I like you. And then I, you'll like me like you'll get back on track like the other guys get. This is the tricks that Jezebels do in order to get the power over you. It's all about power. All of this is all about power, and they use their cheeks in order to get in a position of power. You know, it's a constant validation, ego booster, slash taking your energy, slash working for the dark forces to keep you off track. It's a lot of different elements of what's going on here. It's more than just your personality. It's all about if they can have power over you. You understand? People looking at all sorts of things. These Jezebels are looking at all sorts of things when they deal with when they deal with men. You know, some Jezebels want power. They, I mean, they want power off the break. They only deal with guys they know they can get the power from off the break. They know that look at them as if they're better or higher than them. So they they, they seek men to look for the, if. They look at them as if they're better than them. So they like to feel like the man is trying to impress them. So, and if you're not, and if you're not trying to impress them, then they don't want to, they're going to skip on to the next guy. These are the things that goes on everywhere. Now that the pandemic, this fake pandemic stuff is, uh, it's starting to quiet down because they made it quiet down starting to clear up a little bit. Everybody's starting to get back out there, you know, and meeting and meeting and meeting a lot of people. But you gotta understand is, the only type of man that the Jezebels are gonna get are the beta male providers or beta males. Even if the beta male can't provide, he's a beta male, so he's gonna give whatever he has. So these are the things that a lot of Jezebels are looking for. So, but at the end of the day, most of the time they're not even gonna, it's not even gonna last with the with the beta male provider because a lot of beta males end up, they end up manning up. They started getting, somebody started telling them, you should, you know, they sense that it's not right in their heart, but they go along with it because the girl look good, she got a nice body, you know what I'm saying? So what happens is, Somebody say, man, you don't supposed to go. You, she don't supposed to do that. That's disrespectful. You know what I'm saying? And then they get enough of that, and they realize that, man, I can't. I'm not gonna tolerate this no more. So they was overwhelmed by the, by the Jezebel's beauty. They was overwhelmed by the Jezebel's, you know, body. And all that stuff and the affection. You know, trying to use the sweet tone of voice, holding his hand, sitting on his lap, giving him good sex in the bed. You know, doing all that stuff, but you he have to stay on his pins and needles. He can't speak his mind. It, it's it's stuff to come along with that. He can't speak his mind. He got to take it where she want to go. So she, he have to be her slave in order to get those benefits. And at the end of the day, it's not even worth it because your your soul is, is is out of your stomach. It's out of your body, and you just all you think you're getting is sexual favors. So, I mean, you could get any, you can get that from anywhere. So they, you go through, you jump in mountains just to get that. It's not worth it. I'm Alan, I'm Alan Williams, the Millionaire. Hey, much love to you. Don't forget to subscribe and check out the next video. I'll holler at y'all later.